Okay, go to the skull on Dizzy. You press E, you turn red, you get a backstab, then you get some cool Windigo badge crap. And finally, roll the side at that search crap, and if you type in WE, you got yourself that skin. And, uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. Have fun. For this weird badge, you have to go on the high frights, and you gotta collect skulls around the map. Skull here. You know, it's inside there. Good, good luck. Skull there. You press E, by the way. Another juicy skull here. Here. And the last one is here. Okay, cool. Now, if you go in that side, that little house up there, Satan himself will spawn. And then here's a little circle thing. You press E right there. And then there you go. Get the demon pair. Yeah, you just press E on that square. Place all the skulls. Congratulations, you win the game. And it gives you two skins. It gives you this chick named uh, Mania. I think. Yeah, Ma Manny. I don't know how to pronounce that crap. And then there's another one. Uh, B. 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 Yes, that's a dumb name. On Safe House, the. The sun will change for you, so the sun's going out, and you gotta wait for midnight for the Bigfoot skin on the safe house. And it changed quickly to midnight. I didn't even wait like, <laughs> hell, I didn't wait like a thirty seconds or something like that. It didn't even take that long. And then there's like some big old woods way over there. That's actually pretty big. Then there's Bigfoot right there, and just one tap him. And then yeah, there you go. You, you get the Bigfoot award. It was lit it was literally just a sign you should. For this one on the aircraft, you have to get a snowball or the water balloon. And that is extremely annoying to go ahead and put this out. So it's honestly best just to buy a VIP server and then just rig it with your friends. That's, that's pretty much a go-to thing to do. Okay, cool. My friend has a snowball. You don't need to get it yourself. Uh go ahead and put out the fire. Throw it. Throw the snowball. And there we go. Everyone in the server gets the badge. So that's really cool. You don't need to actually do it yourself. At least for some of these. Uh, this badge. You go over here to this white door. And... Press E on that. And <laughs> he kill people three times. And there we go. I got the badge. That was, that was not that hard. These are the rest of the skins, by the way. The Chupu... Cabra, yeah. Fireman. Big feet. Yeah, but that's really cool. And these guys are free. So, I'm like, that's really cool how there's like a little puzzle for them. And they are totally for free. You don't have to pay. It's just that a VIP server will help you a lot. This part of the video is kind of a bit boring. It's just going to be reviewing maps. So, uh, if you like maps... Stay, stay tuned if you don't. Leave me. Leave now. For, forget about me. Yes, pull size brought back. This, this was a, an extremely controversial map because it is just simply too big. It was simply just too big and extremely annoying to play. And it, it felt like a maze trying to go through people. But now there's a giant rooftop going across before I did not have that. And uh, these little back areas are now fenced off. As you can see right there, you cannot go beyond that range, which is very, very nice because that helps keep the game pace a bit more quicker. Everything looks kind of the same. I can't really tell much of a di uh, too much of a difference. It's like fireworks in the background of, and of course the little map thing I was talking about, where we can't go back here. There might be a couple of decoration changes, but that. That really looks like about it. Oh, cool. Block. I I, I killed him. Pretty sure last year it said June 2019. Now it says June 2020. Nice touch, ICP. There were so soccer balls in this map, but now they are replaced with beach balls. And the surfboards still throw you up, although there's a giant rooftop. So these are essentially worthless. And I am very certain he forgot that these are trampolines, but still left them in the game okay there's zero two and peter griffin now and, and then that dude that's pretty cool you can still go on a rooftop so that's a pretty core gameplay of this map and still manage to break the glass right there big old glasses 
So yeah, that's pretty much the changes. A couple new decorations here and there. And I am still there. My little OG profile. Oh, look, there's there's counselors there now. Nice, look. We're together. That's good. This is a new map. Something I, for, <laughs> I forgot the name already. <laughs> I, for, I forgot the name already. I... Uh, oh, 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 whoops. Anyways, there's a pitfall right there. And this map seems to be pretty open, although there is lots of chances for flanking. Not really sure how this map would play on public servers, as I have not done that as of yet. But I'm like, this looks like an okay design map, although I feel like sometimes there's a bit too much open space and you can die pretty easily or just get shot at from all these buildings. Um, I can't really tell you if this map will perform nicely or not, but at, at, at a first glance, this looks kind of okay, but it seems like you can get spawn killed pretty easily as pretty sure these spawns are mostly in buildings, so, so players just camp the buildings. They, yeah, you can just get spawn killed like that pretty much easily. The, the pitfall. <laughs> Nothing weird, like just a giant boulder next to a tree. That's cool. So yeah, not really much to commentate about this map other than a plain design. I don't really like the ladder thing right here. I kind of hate ladders in this game just because if they're not well put in cover, like some dude can just flank you and then kill you while you're going up the, the ladder. That's why I dislike maps with that. It's just because when you're going up, you can't really defend yourself and they could just one tap you and that is fairly annoying. I already reviewed this map in my video thing, but I just really want to see the paint, the plane crash. Oh yeah, there we go. It just teleported and... God, it looks clean, man. That is a clean animation right there. And nice, nice little sound. I think before it was like some transport plane, but now it's just like... This looks like a fighter plane or something like that. Although there's no guns or something like that. But uh, I just think a bomber wouldn't really have this type of... Engine or transport plane. Transport planes would usually have multiple engines on the side. Uh, this one only has one in the front, so yeah, that's like that's a pretty cool. As for Sandtown, a deeper look into it, not really much. I'm like the the concept is still the same. It just looks extremely detailed now, and there is a couple new things like you can go in here now, which can induce a bit of camping, I guess. Although a bit of new flanking routes as well. Boulder blocks this off. And that is a pretty nice touch right there. Yes, you can even go inside this building to like flank. These little things introduce a bit of camping, but also help prevent spawn killing maybe. Because you can spawn through here. Although players can just camp out the doorways. I think they made the, sh yeah, they, they made the shed worse it looks like. Yeah, you, you can still spawn kill through here, but you spawn more in there now. So when you want to get out, that little extra half a second will probably end up getting you killed so i don't that's the thing i don't like about this change is just that little part right there that's what sucks and this part there was like a wall right there but uh, i guess this helps to like block off shots it, I, I guess it does help and you can go up here it looks like as well that's actually pretty cool so you can camp up here as well but the trees will be in the way would recommend to take that off but uh, other than that generally nice gameplay and it looks like it's a bit more friendly to like get up here and stuff like that because there's a bit of walkways also this little rooftop was replaced with this dome crap i guess <laughs> all the map parts that went that went off from the building and just just went down here cool and this is the new kitchen chaos it received a huge huge redone well uh my the concept is still the same it's just had a lot of new stuff and ICT put a giant model of the self over here. It's a giant model through that glass door thing. Pretty cool. Uh, there's the Joe skin drone, uh, drawn from Jackery's, I believe, and uh, Red Panda. I can mention Roxa for that. Uh, she's a friend I did a, co a couple of collabs with. So that's really cool that her art got in here. And I like that. That's a pretty nice drawing that I pay for. It's a really nice drawing. Uh, go check out her Twitter if you want to. Get more of that juicy stuff and then this this meme this despacito spiders and then my zero two picture that was uh for the old kitchen chaos map is still here i remember uh this was before green screen was a thing so it was actually kind of hard to make sure that the little edges on the side were not screwed up and you can still kind of tell with, with green screen 
that wouldn't really be a problem but there was no green screen at the time except for this little one but uh i wasn't able to access that and then there's bandits over here and there's <laughs> there's me still on the car on, on a couple of, and, and that's like a picture i had like back in 2014 that's so cool the oven over here is now changed you can go through it and there's like a little cake or some crap like that trampoline is now put right there which is gonna help a bit to i don't know not be boring you fell from the map haha <laughs> got him from ict i don't see how it's actually possible to follow through the map without glitching out unless you just die on the ground and a kill effect might glitch out of your camera but other than that i genuinely don't see a way for people to do that uh, also some dressers are exposed now which i guess players can like land in there and then flank you i i guess and you can also like snipe out on, on the vents and maybe uh over here as well on the, on the tip so pretty nice take and there's also chaser chase rooney right there nice beach also received a change although it looks like it's just mostly gonna be lightning i'm not really see seeing too much of a scenery change although the store in here is now an actual store before it's just boring as hell my god it was nothing this right here looks a lot cleaner and there's also rove merch right there that's a nice little take man that's a nice little take how they snuck in some merch and without being like blend like oh this is just boring as advertising screw you roll is actually a really cool thing and a bit more spazazz here the arsenal beach say sorry with chocolate great for eating yourself and apologize and apologizing for spamming the megaphone no eating on a subway and it has a picture of no subway get the joke guys because subway yeah cool yeah funny i laughed beach didn't really get too much done it's mostly just those two shops and a bit on the side as well and then just some useless power boxes on the side of a concrete wall it doesn't look like it's going anywhere uh yeah that's 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 really about it it's just more detail and the stores don't look boring as hell i have no idea what this building is for right here though it's just like stairs and a giant glass cage all right, all right, they couldn't think of a way to make that detail, but hey, man, it's going to make a thing called tons detail as hell. Oh, wait, I didn't even take a look at the skateboards. Nice. Yeah, overall, most of these maps look uh, a lot better now, and uh, definitely glad to see Beach with all that little fan art crap looks. It gives, like, maps a nice vibe. Like, I know that some... Sometimes it's gonna annoy players just because wow he he's there. I hate this guy or some stupid crap like that But for the most part, it's quite enjoyable and um, I like it a lot Very cool. Thank you map creators. Oh This map looks bad 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 